Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I want to show you guys what I believe is the best way to transfer files from your Android device, whether that's a phone or tablet, to your PC. And this is through a app called AirDroid. So the idea is that you download AirDroid to your phone or tablet, and then on your PC you go to web.airdroid.com in your web browser. And on your Android device, you would scan in this QR code. Alternatively, you can sign in with Google and that kind of thing. Uh, but I find that scanning the QR code is the fastest way to do this. So on my Android device, I'm going to go into the AirDroid app, click the scan QR code button, and then we just go ahead, line up the camera um, on the QR code, confirm the sign in. And in the web browser, it's going to go ahead and authenticate. It's going to effectively kind of sign into the phone. And we'll be able to see details about the phone in the top right. If we want to manually go through the entire directory structure of the phone and manually find a file, we can click files right there, um, just like using the Windows File Explorer, except for the Android device. Uh, but I find that the quickest way to get most files off your phone is going to be to go to detail over here in the top right. So I'm going to click that here and it'll show uh, your contacts, apps, music, videos, photos. Um, in most cases, I, I imagine this is what you want to get. So you don't really need to use the files app over here. So I'm going to go to music and uh, here you could download some of the files that you have on your phone, whether that's an audio recording or an actual sound uh, soundtrack. And you just select the files you want um, using the checkbox. You can also select all at once if you want. And you go ahead and hit download where in your browser or whatever download manager you're using, it's going to go ahead and download those files to your Windows machine. So as you can see, it's really easy to get this set up and going. You don't even need to use a USB cable. I'm, I don't even think you need to be on the same Wi-Fi network because it connects in remote connection mode, which I imagine is kind of like... Um, remote desktop connection which is a windows app for viewing someone's computer um so yeah you can just basically connect any of your computers to any of your phones very little trouble pretty much works flawlessly from what i've seen so i would recommend you go ahead and give it a try it's called airdroid you can download it from the android app store and then in your pc once again you just need to go to web.airdroid.com and log in use the qr code and you should be able to get those two devices synced up nicely so I've been Chris, thanks for taking a look at this video, and I will see you guys in my future video content.